Shamika Hosla. Hello, hello everyone. Um, ooh, this one hits me, hits me so hard. Um, Nikki, I, I just remember when I was a young kid and I knew that I wanted to play this game and I fell in love with the Tennessee Volunteers and I never told them this because their head was too big, right? <laughs> but there was a number 23 and I was just like, oh my gosh, she's so fast. So I want to be like her. Let me tell you, I ran from Astoria Housing Projects where I lived all the way to Astoria Park. I used to train and run because I wanted to be as fast as Nikki McCray. It never happened, but I tried. <laughs> Secondly, I just can remember, you know, just going through the growing pains and us not winning and us being the two stars. And we were sisters. And we were, Nikki could come to me and express how she felt, lay it on the line. And I would be upset for a second. And it's like, hey, you want to come by and meet me in Georgetown so we can get something to, to eat? And I would just follow her. And then life happens, right? I grow up. You know, she has Thomas Nick's son. You get it? Nick's son. Just true story. That's why he's named that. <laughs> but I um, remember, you know, becoming a mom. And my first child was born December 14th. Um, a couple years later, we welcomed a little girl December 22nd. And Nikki was like, oh my God, Meek, you love me so much. You can never forget about me because my birthday is December 17th, right between both of your kids. And lastly, I just want to say, oh my goodness, um, Thomas, I mean, your, your strength, I cannot speak enough about it. I was there the day you guys got engaged. I was a freshman in college. We had just beat the USA team in that game in Tennessee, and Thomas proposed. And being teammates, I heckle Nikki all the time. Oh my God, it's 2021, when are you gonna get married? I mean, 2001, when are you gonna get married? Teasing her. And Nikki was like, everything happens when it's supposed to happen. And look at the, just, just look at this, this journey, Thomas. Like, watching you today share stories with Muriel and just talk about all the amazing places, you know, uh, you co Nikki coached and you were there. That's a, that's a strong testament that she chose the right person. And you do it with such a quiet strength. So my hat goes off to you. And lastly, Nikki was a fashionista. So I want all of you fans, to watch the videos they had up of her earlier. She had about eight different hairstyles. Eight different hairstyles. But thank you again, and here the mic goes to Coach T.